is it good enough for you to have a hot tamale? You think? For sure. We're in Texas, right? Yeah, yeah. Dudes, here we are chilling out, and I say chilling out because there's no other way to do it when you're with this guy right here. It's Ernest Green from Washed Out. What's up? What can I say? What's up? <laughs> now, when you come to something like South by Southwest, is it all just um, the day before? All right, this is what we're going to do. Is it a plan of attack? Um, in the past, when we've been here, like the last time we were here two years ago, we did like 12 shows or something over the course of a few days. So at that point, there was no way you could really plan for that outside right. of like knowing when you have to be at each individual place. But being here for one show is like a vacation or something. Like <laughs> getting to be here for a couple of days and like see all the bands and everything. Well, I want you to take us that trip down memory lane a little bit here. Memory lane, yeah. yeah sure. Why? Why not? I mean, I'm going to go back to 2009 when all this um, basically started in your bedroom, didn't it? it was yes. Just a, it was. It was. Uh, it was a baby. It was being birthed. It was. Like, I have been do doing music, just kind of bedroom production stuff for years and years. It was just a hobby and never considered it anything real, like it's yeah, a career got, move or anything. You got your masters, right? Yes, yes. So I was in school and I was kind of just doing music like part time, uh -huh. just late at night in between working or whatever. So um, I put a few songs up on the internet and was lucky enough to kind of be discovered on MySpace. So within and without? Within and without, yeah. That's tell, tell me about that. What is that? What's the story behind that? Um, I don't, I don't, I don't like want to make you cry. Yeah, I don't like I want to, to make them cry. I like to keep some <laughs> mystery. I, like, I don't like to diverge too much detail, but um, yeah, I recorded it um, in this kind of secluded lake house in Georgia. And so it was this really secluded place. I had a little studio set up in a bedroom and Sounds so cool. Yeah, yeah, it was, it was in the middle of summer, so like, uh, you know, I do some work, and then there's a dock outside, it's really peaceful. Going forward, can you take us to this date and beyond? We're doing our first big headlining tour in April in the U.S., and we're doing tons of festivals in Europe in the summer, so we're quite busy until probably uh, August or September, I would guess. So, very exciting thing. Yeah, all over the world, I think. So. It's, it's all good? Yeah, all good. Thanks for uh, letting us know exactly what's going on. Thank you. Yeah.